Right. Welcome back, guys. In today's episode, we'll be learning accidentals, not accidents. <laughs> yes, Ruby. Accidentals. Ever notice these three symbols when you read music? These are called accidentals. First off, we have a sharp. Oh, it looks like a hashtag. Yes, it does, but slightly different. Next, we have a flat, and this is how it looks. Does it remind you of any alphabet, Ruby? Small letter B. Precisely. And lastly, we have a natural, which looks like this. Now let's take a look at the sharp. A sharp promotes the note higher in pitch. By a semitone or a half step, the flat, on the other hand, lowers the note in pitch by a semitone. Let's look at the keyboard. From note D, if we move upwards by a half step or a semitone, it is a D sharp. If we go downwards instead, it will be D flat. Interesting. What about natural? What does it do? Ah, yes. A natural is an accidental, which is used to revert a flat or a sharp note back to its original note. In other words, it represents the unaltered pitch of that note. I see. Cool. Accidentals are drawn. And accurately positioned on the left side of the note head. Now, take a look. Can you tell me the note that goes half a step down from D? It's a D flat. Very good. What about the note that goes half step upwards from C? C sharp. Oh. They are both on the same key, so is that a D flat or a C sharp? Ah, very good question. This is what we call enharmonic notes. Enharmonic notes? Yes, they are notes of the same pitch, but different names. I see. Quiz time. Oh, this is my favorite. Part. Can you tell me if this is drawn correctly? Hmm. Note head is on the first space, but flat symbol is on the second space. That's wrong. The flat symbol should be in the first space, right next to the note head. Very good, Ruby. Next, tell me what this note is. From C, going upwards, so a sharp. It's a C sharp. Good one. Last question. What note is this? Hmm, A flat. Wow, that was quick, Ruby. You are getting better at this already. <laughs> I'm gonna be a maestro in no time. I'm sure, Ruby. That's all for today. In our next episode, we'll be learning music intervals. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel. You can also click on the notification bell icon to receive notification on any new videos from us. Till then, bye bye.